The theme of today is around hope and how we attach to it because it impacts every part of our lives. I was inspired to share this story um, because Tara Brach shared it and I just thought it was quite appropriate. So it's about a young arrogant samurai warrior that demands of an old monk that he tell him the difference between heaven and hell. So the old monk sits and reflects for a while and then replies, you call yourself a samurai warrior? You're just a sliver of a man. You will never amount to anything very much. The samurai says, what? And goes to draw his sword. And the monk says, ah, I see you're going to draw your sword. You couldn't even cut a head of a fly off with that. The samurai was so incensed and infuriated that he drew his sword, raised it above the old monk's head, and was about to strike him. When the monk looked into those seething eyes of the samurai and said gently, that's hell. When the samurai warrior realized that the monk had risked his life to teach him this lesson, he thought about the compassion that the monk was showing him and he put his sword down and fell to his knees with gratitude. And the monk said softly, that's heaven. So when we are in our own hell, we believe in badness, ours, or someone else's and that life is not unfolding in the way we want it to and here's where hope enters the story when we connect with some aliveness in our body like connecting with compassion for others the possibility of gratitude arises and also of hope because if we think the world is not a safe place to be then we live it limit our possibility horizons. Hope buffers us from stress and anxiety and we experience well-being when we are hopeful. So hope is around potential and possibilities. It does depend on what we're hoping for of course. Are we grasping at something that we want? Some consumerism here maybe. Um, we're just hoping for the next new car, new iPhone, new something. Or is it just hoping for things to be how we want them to be? Or is it a deep sense of knowing that things will unfold just as they should? And being okay with that. And also and knowing that we will fulfill our potential just as we are meant to. Thank you.